of Sam. Welcome to Seen Through Glass and welcome to Dubai and my rental car. While Shmi 150 and Yanni from Yanamai are cruising around in supercars, I am keeping it real with this Ford Fiesta. Let's jump in and head into Dubai. Now the question is, which side of the road do they drive on in Dubai? I've completely forgotten. Okay, just a crazy man. Learn to drive, a-hole! Um, we are here. I mean, literally, I have had about half an hour's sleep, so I feel like a complete mess. I've got googly mappies on. I'm in this beautiful Ford Fiesta. I actually rented the cheapest car I could find on a last minute car rental website. This car has cost me 20 pounds a day. It is brilliant. I'm so happy and I thought I was getting some like real awful car I'd never heard of. And instead I ended up with a Ford Fiesta, so I'm loving life. But yeah, first things first, I need coffee ASAP and I need food because I just feel like a mess right now. And I need to figure out what side of the road I'm supposed to be on. Okay, food and coffee now inside me. I feel like a remarkably different person. Now, I actually came to Dubai for the first time uh, last year. Some of you may remember, uh, we came as a group. Me, Paul Wallace, Seb Delaney, Shmi. Um, and we were here for like 10 days like that. And it was pretty awesome. But uh, for me, it felt a little bit too long. So this year, I've gone radical. Firstly, I've come alone. So uh, Paul and Seb and James aren't coming. I think Tim is coming, but on slightly different dates. Anyway, and I've only come for three days. So I literally, I've arrived this morning, it's Friday morning, and I leave again on Sunday night. I have no tickets to the Grand Prix. I have no real plans. I am just hoping to explore and see some cool stuff because it was one thing I really didn't do last year was explore Dubai. We were so busy and had so much going on that I didn't have a chance to really go around and see what it was like as a city. So yeah, that is the plan for the next couple of days. I'm gonna be kind of daily vlogging, I guess, bringing you guys along with me as I try out various activities. But of course, if you know, there's a really loud beetle in front of me. If you know Dubai at all, you will know that you cannot go more than 100 meters without seeing some kind of cool car. So do not fear. Daily vlogs does not mean no cars. Dripping, I'm just floating with this dosage of potent. No photos, I can't live unless it's moment to moment. Some loathing the tailor clothing, no hoes, it just made me folding. Might represent the rest of my hoes and voting for a quotient. Like, damn, I'm just kidding. Hoes ain't voting. As a tad little kid, like a lot of people. Got enough hard to leave. Okay, I'm always getting a little bit of hope. First things first, the first thing I want to do as soon as I land in Dubai was go supercar shopping. And no, it's not because I'm looking for an F-type replacement in Dubai to ship back. It's because if you didn't know, Dubai has some of the best supercar dealerships in the world. And whilst James and Seb and Paul aren't out here this year, uh, there have been a ton of other YouTubers and Instagrammers and etc. that have been here this week. So Yanni, uh, James the Strad man, a whole lot of London car spotters, and they have been going around to some of the supercar dealerships and posting some ridiculous videos and photos of the stuff that is in stock. So I knew as soon as I landed and I picked up my beastly rental car. I was gonna go straight to do some supercar shopping. Dripping, I'm just floating with this dosage of potent. No photos, I can't live unless it's moment to moment. So I'm loathing the tailor clothing, no hoes, it just made me folding. Might represent the rest of my hoes and voting for a quotient. So here we go, we've arrived at the first dealership of today's jaunt, Deals on Wheels. I've actually followed on Instagram for ages. They look remarkably closed, but let's go and investigate. What is crazy is you get this mad cars driving along the bloody highway here in Dubai. That was a V12 Vantage. That was a 458 two seconds ago when we turned up. Now, I can see some pretty cool cars in here. Let's 
So yes, Deals on Wheels closed. Uh, it is a, a holiday here. Friday is like Dubai Saturday. But to be honest, nothing that crazy in there. Oh my god. House of <gasps> House of Cars are smashing live. Look at these guys. Are these guys open? No, these guys aren't open either. I have royally buggered this up. Look at this LT. Woo! What a lovely looking thing. Well, I think you would call that a complete fail. Um, first stop for supercar shopping and three dealerships all closed. I didn't show there's an Onyx, Onyx dealership as well, but they didn't really have anything interesting in the window. Last year, Paul and I attempted this. He wanted to do an Indisco car shopping and we got dropped off by an Uber to try and walk between all the car dealerships and they were all closed. I've come back a year later to try and do the same thing and they're all closed. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Now, I'm not going to completely give up yet. Whilst I think that was quite a bad sign, I'm going to try Alan Class Motors because that is another pretty um, iconic and famous supercar dealership. I get the feeling like that might be closed as well today. I think maybe Friday was a bad idea to try and do some supercar shopping, but I'm determined because I've just turned up and I want to see some cool cars. I think I'm probably going to see better cars on the road, but uh, what is Susie's up? Chill out! I don't know where I'm going. Piss off! Ah! I can I just say I hate driving in Dubai. I'll get that out there. Fiesta, amazing. People in Dubai, douchebags. Ah! Next stop, Alain Class, and guess what? It's closed! <laughs> However, there is an insanely mean Brabus G-Wagon 4x4 squared. Let's check this thing out. So all in all, a total bloody fail for day one, but I am seeing some insane stuff cruising around. So I'm gonna go to the mall because I need to pick up a few things like sun cream and toothpaste and the mall often provides good spotting opportunities as well. So I'm gonna carry on bringing you guys around with me for the day, uh, but I apologize that my attempt to go and check out some Stuttgart dealerships has gone so horribly wrong. I am crap at doing things by myself. Now, I'm not entirely sure how many seats a Nissan Maxima has, but I'm pretty sure I can count more heads than there are seats. So at least six or seven in there. Adventure to the Mall now complete. Uh, some reasonably good cars in the valley, nothing amazing. We're now following a 430 Spider out of the mall, which just continues the madness that is Dubai. I'm so excited for this weekend, just to see what cars are hanging around. Um, now, this morning has been a bit of a shit show, because obviously, totally unplanned, and I've kind of messed up on a number of occasions. The reason being that we landed at 7 a.m. this morning, and I can't check into the hotel until 2 p.m., which it is now. So I've kind of been killing time, um, which is why I think it was kind of so um, unplanned and last minute. Uh, but we've still seen some very cool stuff. I'm now gonna go to the hotel, drink more coffee, have a nap, um, and then replan my day. Um, at the minute, I'm a jet-lagged mess, but I'm thoroughly enjoying being back in Dubai and seeing supercars galore. <laughs> And finally, I've made it to my hotel room. I am so excited to lie down. Um, as I say, today has been very much a sort of travel vlog and introduction uh, to my time here in Dubai. I've got a couple more days. Uh, tomorrow, I'm off to the sand dunes, something I really missed out of last year. Um, hopefully doing some buggy camel riding expeditions, and then God knows what in the afternoon. And then Sunday, uh, even though I haven't got tickets to the race, I'm gonna head over to Abu Dhabi, uh, Yas Marina, hopefully as part of a sort of supercar convoy with the Strad Man. 
more of that to come soon. Uh, there won't actually be a video live tomorrow though, the videos will go live on Sunday and Monday, so don't expect a video tomorrow. There'll be bumper content on Sunday, Monday from Dubai. I hope you guys have enjoyed this slight uh, introduction vlog today. Make sure to subscribe for plenty more videos to come.